Ah, first dates. They can be a nerve-wracking business, can't they? Full of anticipation and uncertainty. Will this person like me? Will I like them? It's amazing any of us ever go on a first date. But what if I could get you some advice that would really impress? Now, this is Gerard Basset, who is one of the best sommeliers in the whole wide world, so there's nothing he doesn't know about wine. Gerard, I think that if I was on a first date, then a bit of wine knowledge from the other person would really impress. So are you prepared to share some of your knowledge today? Oh, let's share some knowledge. That would be nice. Excellent. Oh, I think she's going on a date, and she looks so sophisticated, very elegant. Perhaps they're going to have one drink here and then go to the theatre or something. Mm. If he's got to impress her, what French wine should he order that is nice and chic and elegant and impressive? Sophisticated people like them really need a chic wine. Mm. So maybe a red wine from Bordeaux, a Médoc, with very subtle aroma of blackcurrant, cedar wood, firm but ripe, really superb. Or white wine from Bourgogne, mm -hmm. Puy Fusé, mm -hmm. a little aroma of uh, tropical fruit, also some nuts, it's dry, but it's very smooth, very, very elegant. The thing is, on a first date, sometimes, unlike the wine, the conversation doesn't always flow. <laughs> Keep the first date conversation light-hearted. Now isn't the time to talk about your looming accounting deadline at work. For a sophisticated date, art and culture is a great conversation starter. Make an effort with your appearance so you look and feel great, which will make you radiate confidence, even if you don't feel it inside. Oh, hello, Gerard. Have you seen him in the mm. corner? He looks like Mr. Cool to me. Mm. And I think if I was on a first date, I would definitely go to the bar. I would take the lead, you know, to impress, just as she has, actually. Mm. So if she was buying a wine for him, and he does look very cool, I bet he can get a date many nights of the week. <laughs> Then she needs something laid back, something they can enjoy, take their time over. What's going to impress? Well, I think something, as you say, very cool and laid back. Mm -hmm. Maybe um, a red wine from the Beaujolais, so something light, fruity. Perhaps a wine from the Languedoc, a white wine. IGP, Paydoc, made with a Viognier grape, with a lovely aroma of peach, apricot, flowers. Be perfect for this occasion. Lovely. So you have recommended smooth wines for mm. Mr. Smoothie. It's perfect. <laughs> Play cool by engaging in friendly banter, smile, laugh and have fun. Show them your best side. Calling ahead to make a reservation, arriving on time unflustered and making an effort with the venue will really get the date off to a great start. If you want a second date, you should probably avoid any talk about marriage or babies unless you want to see them running for the hills. Who knew that you you were a dating expert as well as a wine connoisseur. Always happy to help. <laughs> Always happy to help. Oh, you have. Thank you so much Thank for those lovely much. tips on these gorgeous French wines. Santé. Santé. I feel ready for a date, <laughs> I think. I know what to order. <laughs>